Basis of Classification Animal Kingdom is classified based on the body symmetry, arrangement of cells, germinal layer, nature of coelom, segmentation and presence of notochord. The nature of coelom, segmentation and presence of notochord are explained briefly in this section. Levels of Organization All members of Animalia are multicellular but exhibit different levels of organization. 1. Cellular level In unicellular animals and some multicellular animals, the cell is responsible for all the metabolic activities in the animal body. This type of organization of function is termed as cellular level of organization. 2. Tissue level In certain animals, cells performing the same function are arranged in a group. Example, cylindrates. 3. Organ level Some animals form specialized organs for specific functions. Example, platyhelminthes. 4. Organ system level. In higher and complex animals, various organs group to form a complex organ system to perform specific function. Example, mollusk, caudata. Symmetry. Planes passing through the body, dividing it into equal halves. Animals can be categorized on the basis of their symmetry. Sponges are mostly asymmetrical. That is, any plane that passes through the center does not divide them into equal halves. Radial symmetry. When any plane passing through the central axis of the body divides the organism into two identical halves, it is called radial symmetry. Cylindrates, tenophores, and echinoderms have this kind of body plan, bilateral symmetry. Animals like annelids, arthropods, etc., where the body can be divided into identical left and right halves in only one plane exhibit bilateral symmetry. Diploblastic and triploblastic organization. Animals in which the cells are arranged in two embryonic layers, an external ectoderm and an internal endoderm are called diploblastic animals. Example, cylindrates. An undifferentiated layer, mesoglia, is present in between the ectoderm and the endoderm. Those animals in which the developing embryo has a third germinal layer, mesoderm, in between the ectoderm and endoderm are called triploblastic animals, platyhelminthes to chordates.